all your hydraulic double station heat press machine. Uh, the bottom uh, heating plate glide heat press machine. This is 60 cm by 80 cm size. Now this is the control panel. This is the um, temperature and the timer in home 2 in 1 intelligent controller. First, let's, uh, let's test, uh, just adjust the, uh, the temperature degree. First, uh, we press this ICT button once. The first row becomes 5H. Uh, the second row is the, the, the uh, temperature we need. You could uh, um, press this up arrow to increase temperature. And you could also press this down arrow to decrease the temperature. Now we um, press this ICT button twice. The first row becomes file uh, and reverse F. And the second row is the time we need. <coughs> we could uh, press this up arrow to increase the time. And you could also press this down arrow to decrease the time. Normally we set it uh, 25 seconds for the sublimation transfer. And then we can press this SET button again to finish the setting. Now the machine, the first row is the real the machine temperature degree, and the second is the machine setting degree. Now, uh, it's just the comp equal to each other. Now, this is the manual automatic switch. When this manual, uh, you turn it left, it's the manual stage. When, uh, then you can have to press this green button. This is the manual start switch to uh, uh, to start the, uh, let the machine work. Uh, and uh, if you want to uh, the automatic uh, situation, you could uh, switch this button to the right hand. Then the machine become automatic. Okay, this is the emergency stop. If the machine you want to stop it, just press this button. The machine will stop work. And uh, if you want to restart the work, you have to press this uh, clockwise. The machine will restart the work. This is the counter. Uh, counter, uh, counter. You can see that uh, once the the heating plate uh, um, press one time, it will count count for one for one degree. If you want to clean it up, you, you should press this button. Then it becomes zero. Okay, this is the power switch. Now oh, it's uh, the control introduction finish. And let's test this machine. You can see this is the <coughs> bottom working plate. This is the high, high temperature sponge. This is the wool blanket. And this is the polyester fabric. First, we display the fabric on this working plate. And then this is the sublimation paper the paper should face down the face down the clothes face down the fabric remember it must be very smooth okay first we test this machine on the situation on our let's press our manual tab we push this working table um, to the this place and we we press this green button, the machine will start work. And the timer will count down from 25 seconds to zero. Mm. Once the, the, uh, the time finish, the fitting plate uh, will lift up automatically. Okay, the time almost finished, let's see. Because you no know, the ink is liquid, you see, it can uh, can happen the, the, the smoke. You can see the paper already transferred to the fabric, and the printing is very beautiful. You can see the printing is so bright and beautiful. And now let's test the machine on the automatic slippers. First, we need to we need to turn this button to the right hand. Then you can see we display this already. This is the polyester fabric, and this is the sublimation sublimation paper. We need to display this sublimation paper face down to the fabric, and then 
we put this working table for the so the parallel with the heating base and it automatically press down and the timer will come down from 25 seconds to zero. It's the same once the time finish the machine will automatically lift up and the printing finish. Submission paper is printed by ink. Ink is limited, it's liquid, so it's normal for some smoke. You can see the printing effect is very beautiful. Okay, very bright.